Welcome to DPV Technology. What is PWM? Before going to the definition of PWM, let us observe this circuit. An LED is connected to a voltage source and current is flowing through the circuit all the time. So the LED will be on for all the time. What will happen if we apply voltage to the LED for certain duration of time and then we will not supply voltage to it for a certain amount of time and this process will be repeating. Here is the simulation. We are supplying voltage for 50% of the time and then we will not supply voltage to 50% of the time. Here you see the graph, 50% turn on and 50% turn off in every cycle. You can see that current will flow through the LED for 50% of the time and it will off for a 50% of time in every cycle. So the average voltage across the LED will reduce to 50% of the supply voltage. CWM or pulse width modulation is the technique of sensing the average voltage to a circuit by sensing the width of the pulse. PWM technique is used in various applications to reduce the power loss. If we want to reduce the supply voltage 50% across this LED, we can use one resistance in between power supply and LED. But in that case, we have to loss power because resistance will produce heat and that will be a loss of power but if we will switch on and off at 50 percent time then average voltage will automatically fall to 50 percent and the there will be no loss of power so this technique is very efficient technique and that is why it is widely used. Now let us observe the circuit by sensing the width of the pulse. Now it is in 50% width. Now we will sense it from 50 to 70%. You can, we can observe that the LED will be turned on for 70% of the time and it will turn off for 30% of the time. We can also observe the graph here 70% on and 30% off. So in this case, so LED average voltage across the LED will be 70% of the supply voltage. Now let's decrease the width of the pulse. Now we sense it to 30%. So we can see that it will turn on for 30% of the time and turn off for 30% of the time in a cycle. So this is called actually duty cycle. Duty cycle is the proportion of time during which a component or a device or a system is active. In this case, we are using here, you can see, here we can see here which is 30 percent that means it is operating the 30 percent time in a cycle so here the duty cycle is 30 percent if we increase or decrease it then duty cycle will be sense so we can sense the intensity or brightness of the led by sensing the duty cycle by applying a PWM signal. This PWM signal is generally generated by microcontroller or other devices. Now let us see with practical example using Arduino and an LED. Arduino Uno has six PWM pin, pin number three, five, six, nine, ten, and eleven. We can use these pins as digital as well as pwn pin here we are using three leds one is red that is connected to pin number nine of the arduino 
one is green that is connected to pin number 10 and one is blue that is connected to pin number 11 of the arduino and this is the common ground so it is in the code it is right written like this we are using one integer variable for changing the pwm value we have to use analog write function for generating pwm a call to analog write is on a scale of 0 to 255 that means if we write analog write a led or the pin number then if we write zero here that means zero percent duty cycle if we write analog write red led 255 that means 100 percent duty cycle so here we are using 10 percent duty cycle that's why 10 percent of 255 is 25 that's why we have written here 25 around 25 25.5 that's why we have written here 25 that means the red led is in 10 percent of duty cycle then we are using this green led we are turning on this green led at 70 percent of duty cycle 70 percent of 255 is 178.5 that's why we have written here to 179 then for this blue led we are changing the duty cycle from 0 to 250 0 to 100 percent that's why we are written a for loop for i equal to 0 to 255 i plus plus every time it is increasing one percent and thus duty cycle is changing from 0 to 255 and then we are decreasing here we are increasing from 0 to 255 that is 0 to 100 percent and from and in this loop we are decreasing the duty cycle from 100 percent to zero percent that's why you can see observe this led we can observe this led that it is you we are observing that it is bright it is now intensity is now increasing and after some time you, we can observe that intensity is decreasing. So thank you for watching this video.